Today's Honoring Black History story comes to us from a distance of more than 300 miles away. WGNO's LBJ has a story from Montgomery, Alabama. Honoring Black History, Mind, Body, and Soul, brought to you by the King Firm. This is the Dexter Avenue King Memorial Baptist Church. Dr. King once served this pastor here. In fact, he organized the Montgomery bus boycott here back in 1955. Just beyond the church is the Southern Poverty Law Center and their Civil Rights Memorial. They have fought for racial equality for over 50 years. The legacy of the Civil Rights Movement is what teaches us how we need to go about actually getting the rights that we deserve. An important soldier in the fight for civil rights has been the Southern Poverty Law Center. We are a national civil rights organization. We just celebrated our 50th anniversary. Um, 50 years, hard to believe, right? Um, and we are still doing the work of combating hate, white supremacist organizations, but we are also dealing with issues such as economic justice, children's rights, and systemic racism that continues to impact communities of color. In tribute to 40 martyrs of the movement, the space that is the memorial exists. Had it not been for the individuals out there on the memorial who were standing up long before there was an SPLC in 1971, there would be no Southern Poverty Law Center. The Civil Rights Memorial Center is an interpretive center that shares that history, hoping to also change the conversation about blacks in America. And so there's this narrative here um, that we are an oppressed Southern entity and that black people don't possess power. And we know, in fact, that that's not true. A visit to the center's theater showcases a viewing of the powerful short apathy is not an option. And the Memorial Center's exhibits managed to weave in a call to action in the struggle for the rights of all told by the community itself. If you don't tell the story, it gets lost and people will forget. I want people to walk away from here knowing about issues that they didn't know about before, how it's impacting their communities and how they can be a voice in their community. Honoring black history, mind, body and soul, I'm LBJ.